Ooh, you're gonna be big. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back. Tom Cannock Simulator 2018, baby. Let's prepare some faults. Some leaf springs. Some leaf U boats. Engine block I4C, which, oh, that looks like that repaired. Very good, very good. All the modded parts, because today we are checking out. It's an old timey car. Yeah, see, it's old timey. It's a Bentley blower. It's made by Gollywog. It looks fantastic. It's pretty, it's sexy, it's got some parts on it, and we're gonna remove them and see how well we do. Boom. Uh, grill, grill, anybody? Grill, okay, okay. Just grabbing as many pieces as I can. Uh, let's see, front seat, yeah, right, right, right. Let's grab you, let's go back into normal, normal. Uh, fenders, we already kind of lost those fenders. Oh, realize so we gotta take that off. Right. So, not a whole lot of parts that are actually, I, well, not that I'm seeing anyway. I'm sure there's plenty of parts that we have to rock and roll with. Um, I've not replaced the bottom half of this. It's actually pretty, uh, it's pretty simple. Just go ahead and do it. Let's do it to it. And we're also going to check out the uh, modified wheels now that you can do. And, oh, of course, leaf spring didn't, didn't repair. Um, it is a setting that you have to mess around with in the uh, game settings of the initial opening screen. So if you go into the opening screen, go into settings, uh, you'll have uh, a setting there that lets you get ridiculous wheel sizes. You just have to turn that on, and then you can make the wheel sizes anything you, anything your heart desires come true to you. Very good. The spring, beautiful. Everything's repairing. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. Alright, let's go ahead and put some a small rubber bushes. We have a whole bunch of from the last job, so I just headed on to them. Um, the engine that we're going to be messing around with, I don't think has too many performance parts that we can mess around with other than pistons and spark plugs, which is fine because we don't want this thing to go too fast. Because, I mean, it is a Bentley blower, which uh, was pretty fast for what it was back in the day. I think it won a... I think it holds like a land, land speed record back in the day. Something stupid. Let's grab two of you. Uh, competed in the uh, Le Mans 24-hour race. It's got some history to it. And it's fancy looking. You can't beat that. You can't beat that at all. Well, you can. I mean, it's a slow car. I mean, it's so slow. But, in comparison, once uh, we get some of the performance pieces and performance parts in there, it will look and possibly drive more fantastic than it's ever driven ever in its life. At least that's the goal. So, rubber bushings. And I believe this has the rear axle nozzle. No. B. This has the uh, Jeep Willis frame to it. Set up where well, there's no uh, like double wishbone shock absorbers in the front. It's all leaf springs. It's all front end, front end loaded scripts. Uh, let's go ahead, solid. Spin you up, buttercup. And we'll put you on the drum wheel cylinder, which is all fixed up and good to go. It's wonderful. Alright, so let's go ahead and get some brake shoes. Gotta get two of them. My children need shoes. My last paycheck bounced. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're gonna need a fuel tank too. Gonna need a fuel tank, baby. Fuel tank. Boom. Hello. I see you there. Don't worry, I got some performance parts for you. I got everything right for I got I got everything you need right here. I got it right here. Uh hut. There you are. Of course. Of course. Why would that be fixed? Why would that be fixed? Why won't you be fixed? You're killing me, Smalls. 
You're killing me, Smalls. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. It's front drive axle I. Correct. Yeah. Front. Uh huh. Hey. <laughs> For some reason, I could not see that. I was like, what am I. What's going on? Why is everything weird? Ah, uh, let's go ahead and put them. Ah, well, Lith Springs, how dare you not. How dare you not all repair. Uh, two of you. Nice. Nice. Nate. Yeah, super duper Nate. Yeah, super duper Nate, guys. And I'll also grab a U bolt as well, along with the leaf plate. Because I believe. We're going to need them. Just one, though. Just one. Just one. Everything repaired. Small rubber bushings. Good. It's beautiful. From the front, front shock absorber B. Nice. And small rubber bushings over here. Steering rack. Is that repaired? Of course not. Why would why, why would why would have that repaired? I mean, what are the odds? Very slim. Very, very, very slim. I've already pre purchased the tie rods because we need them. From steering knuckle E. We gotta spin you around here, get that outer tie rod on there. Don't forget front steering knuckle E ring. So. Steering knuckle E, we're gonna need one of them, and we're gonna need an E ring as well. Very good, very good indeed. Wheel hub four, and we're gonna need a wheel hub. Wheel hub four. Awesome. Ugh, driver, ever all this old all these old parts. All these old parts are not helping me out. Uh what was that again? Front drive axle F. Yeah. Front drive axle F. Front drive shaft. Drive axle F. Gotta go alphabetically. That's what my problem is. Alright, drum cylinder. Beautiful, they're all repaired. We've also got the brake shoes and a brake drum. Boom. Now this should go relatively quick because we have all the pieces that we need to put everything together and come together. Boom, 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 right now. Over me. Boom, 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 boom. I love listening to Spotify and just having some uh, sort of like older, uh, older song playlist just kind of roll in, just kind of creep in on you. And you're like, hey, what's this? Let's get some work done. You know what I'm saying? That happened a few times, and it happens. When it happens, it's great. Especially if you're feeling it too. Especially if you're feeling that kind of music. You're like, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Hard rock, man. 70s. We have four. Drive axle. Sonar. Brake shoe. Brake pad. Gorgeous. Uh, let's drop you down now. And let's grab the rotator seat. And we'll get to work on the engine. Which literally has. It just had the engine block and the camshaft. So we have to basically build this thing from scratch. That's okay. It's fine. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. No, no. We're, we're going to be fine. That and of course that doesn't that doesn't that doesn't work either. All right. All right. So I foresee, I foresee us having some good times with this. Uh. Uh. Okay. Uh, manifold and I foresee. We're gonna need another part that goes along with that. But I don't quite recall. We'll figure it out. Alright. 
Uh, so we'll get some performance parts as well when it comes to the fuel filter. Because we can't get that through loot crates. No, you can't. And we've got everything else we need. Okay, so water pump I foresee. Like I told you, we're gonna need everything for all of this. It's gonna be a good time. So we're gonna water pump fully while we're here. Uh, let's go ahead, I foresee. And we're gonna need some arms. I need my arm. Why do you need an arm, man? Just do. If I call something different. Just trying to be different. Let's drop you here. Okay. Let's put on the crankshaft. And the camshaft I foresee. Okay, I was just making sure that we didn't have a performance part. Because that would have been awesome. But that's okay. That's just fine. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be okay. Let's go ahead and put the pistons in there, which I do have. It's like the one thing I have. Got spark plugs, I got all that. Everything else is from scratch because we don't have everything. It's a mess, which is the mess. I want to get the rod caps on the bottom too. We'll do that later. We'll do that later. What do you say? All right, so we have no pieces whatsoever. We got the ignition coil. We can go ahead and start filling in some of the stuff we do have in stock. We've got our flywheel because we still fly. We also have our clutch plate and pressure plate. And we'll have to get a clutch bearing cap because we're clutch. Boom. Nice. Nice. Super duper nice. And all right, so we'll head over here to the ignition distributor because we have all the performance parts for that as well. Because I think I do, which I do not. <laughs> it's like, mm, uh, it would be nice if I had that. All right, cap. We're also gonna need some clip bees to keep that thing from popping off. Clip two of those. Beautiful. Lovely. We're gonna need wires too, but that is for later. Later. It's for later. Clip B. Nice. All right. So here's where all the other uh, crap comes into play. Oil filter base. Uh, I'm gonna need an I4C. The base. We'll need the cover. Uh, I4C. Beautiful. Um. Hmm. See there. All right. Okay. Put the cap on it. Uh, isn't there something like below? No, no, I'm thinking something different. Okay, RMB I6B, air filter base I4C, air filter base. You know, if only. E, all right cover the base I have this I basically need every single one of these pieces it is no bueno uh, we'll grab uh, I don't think I'm not sure if the gearbox has been uh, taken care of there we'll grab one of you we'll grab ignition wires too intake manifold yes transfer case I'm not sure if that it will need a timing cover that's true this is true. I'm not sure about the gearbox. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about the transfer case either. I think we could be okay with that, so I don't want to spend the money. Let's be frugal about it. All right. Lots of bolts. Holy crap. Jeez. Look like a lot of bolts. A lot of bolts bolts in there. All right, let's get our spark plug, performance part. This is gonna go. This is go. This thing's gonna go so fast, man. Let me just see something here. Um, any performance pieces? Any wires we can get? Mm, uh, no. Hmm. <laughs> mm, no. 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 Definitely not. 
Oh, okay. All right, put that there. We'll get that fuel filter on here. And let's get the air filter base. Drop it like it's hot. On there, we'll get that manifold. Intake manifold. Told you I was going to need it. Told you. I done told you. Carburetor. <laughs> uh, carbs. I had the carbs, bro. Any carbs up here? No carbs, bro? Huh? Huh? No? Okay. Never mind. Carburetor. I4B. We got a whole bunch of a slew of pipes. <laughs> we have a bunch of little. I think it's gonna be. Uh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, converter. I need one of them. And that's good. Fuel pump. Fuel pump. Fuel pump. I like it when we mess around with uh, new, uh, new engines that we have not uh, done too much of. Especially when it comes on a modded car. Just makes that a little bit special. Nice. B6B. Can't wait to see what the belts look like on this. Look like on this. Look, look, look like on this. Oh my goodness. Arm. Uh, I6. Yep, we're going to need that. You got any one of you? And that's where we mount all of our little water pops. I6B. Man, that's a weird. Alright. 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 Fine. If you say so. If you say so. I do say so. Ugh. 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 <laughs> Cam gear. I6B. Whoops. There we go. Sorry there, sport. Boom. And we got a time chain. We got a water pump. Huh? Uh, arm I6B. Arm. Did I get one of those? I think I did. I think I did. I did. Super early in the morning. Ugh. I can't even put a performance alternator on here. We're just a mess. We're just a mess. Alternator. I see. There's two alternators. <laughs> That's it. This is one alternator for this one specific thing. All right. Timing. Uh, timing chain. Beautiful. We'll grab you. Ow. Put timing cover on there. Looking good. Ugh. And what kind of pulley? I6? V8. Of course. Why wouldn't it? Of course. Of course. V8. Beautiful. It's beautiful, man. And a belt. Two of them. Belts. I6B. We're going to need an I6C as well. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? So people are, are so triggered right now. Um, I6P. Right. Come on. All right. Yeah. All right. Oh. And ready to defend B. Really? Really? Okay. I'm not sure that repaired or not. We'll buy one anyway. We'll buy one anyway just in case. Just in case. We're feeling it, you know? Alright, so let's go ahead and flip this thing around real quick. Whoop. Whoop. And let's mount them up. Get some rod caps in here. I think I need to get some different kinds of crankshaft bearing caps. Cranking, just cranking them out. Crankshaft barrier cast. Uh, let's get three just to, just to be safe. If not, I'll use them for another thing. Oh, it's gonna be the perfect amount. Awesome. That's just fantastic. 
That's just amazing. Not caps. Show you in with a grin. And no me better man. Fantastic. I foresee an oil pan. Nice. That's super duper nice. It's a green machine. Mmm. Okay. So we'll take you. Take off the engine stand. Drop it in the car. And then we'll move you back. We shall move you. Let's go ahead and move all this fun stuff over as well. It's beautiful. No, wrong, wrong. Yes, clean, clean, I tell you. Now we'll move you back. Now you're fancy. Mm-hmm. Now let's see if any of those panels that we messed around with... Did nothing fixed. <laughs> nothing prepared. It's all a mess. It's just a mess. Oh, okay. No one else to work with. Oh, thought I had some of these. Guess not. <sighs> I suppose not. Oh, there's a fender. Didn't repair though. Oh, hold on. The rear window is the muffler. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. All right. So, as far as parts go, tires. Now, with these uh, specific mods, now the 215 is a 24-inch rim with the 215 width. Now, the base would be normally like 225, 235 or something like that. So if you click the settings, and before you even hop into the game, at the main menu, settings, game settings, and you'll see the different tire settings, just click that to yes, and then you can modify the tire size the way that you want. So we got 24 inch rim, rim retro 12, and we need three of them actually, rim retro 12, All right. Rim retro 12, 24 inch. Remember, row. row. 12, 24 inches. Grab three of them. Now we'll need 215.75. Vintage tire B. Let's grab four of them. 24 inch. 215. See, it starts off at 135. How low does it go? 135 with a profile of 20. That's the lowest you can go. So, we've got 215, 75. I believe that's what we needed. 215, 75. Oh, good, 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 good. That's going to look hecka nice. Hecka nice? Yes. Beautiful. Install you. Fancy. Alright, so let's go over to our interior shop. You're gonna need the typhoon. Typhoon seats. Just one seat typhoon. Let's get a nice old timey wheel. A good old time yes, let's get a grab a typhoon wheel, baby. Just grab one. You know you want it. Just grab that wheel. Booyah. Body shop takes a little time to load up because of all the parts. Hey, look at you. Oh, look at you. You're fancy. Get the blower, get the rims. You must get it all and try to figure it out. How to put it all on. Or a window. That'll be the interesting part. Alright. Boom. Boom. Balance it out. It's pop, 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 pop. You want? Nath, you're gonna be a mystery. You're gonna be a puzzle, ain't you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I figured as much. I figured as much. Pop. So you balance you. Looking good. All right.
on this wheel. Grab you. Good, good. Go ahead and pop. It popped. But it pops and it's done. Learned that at Thanksgiving. When the thing pops, it's done. Oh! This is not true all the time. Don't believe the hype of the thermostat. Don't believe it. No, I wouldn't believe it. Nice. Okay. So let's go ahead and we'll pop on the left body panel. Left body window. What the? Ah, right door first, huh? Then the left door. Oh, I already fixed it. I see what you did there. Okay, so this panel has to go on first before this panel. Because I already fixed this up. It's all nice and shiny. But we have a set we have a second one. That's okay. We'll just sell it. Let's go ahead and put the front end on. Oh, that's nifty. Fancy headlights. Detail is fantastic. Let's go ahead and put the window on. That's a little bit lovely right there. Let's get to put the left tail light on. Put that on. I did not even realize that that was a thing. So we'll take that off. And the left fender. And we're going to need a license plate. Do we have a Britain? We do. I don't think about a custom one. I think we just need one license plate. There we go. British plates. And what are we looking at? Global body condition, 85. I'm missing something, obviously. Global parts condition. What am I missing? What am I missing here? Piston rings? No, I'm not I'm not missing those. Oh, yeah, the drive shafts and everything. That's fine. Radiator C, transfer case. Yeah, right. Uh, but what about the body parts? Mm. Oh, yeah, the seats. Ha! <laughs> uh, let's go ahead. Uh, double load. Double no. Mmm. Mmm-mm. -mm. There we go. Oh, we're going to need two of them. Okay. I get two of them. Let's put the steering wheel on. Wrong. Get them seats. Get them seats going, baby. Typhoon. Nice. And did we put the tire on? We did. That's 100%. Let's go ahead and we'll lift this John up here. Oh, we also need to put the radiator in the front. Don't let me forget that. I'm sure the game won't. So, uh, hut. Nice. It did fix. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. We'll need a starter. From the engine bay. You... You rat bastard. I'll tell you what. We have to put the radiator on anyway. So we'll put the transfer case on. Nice. That prepared. Now for the drive shafts. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. So close. We are so close, yet so far away. Drive shaft. And there's possible another another possible drive shaft that could be could be needed some replacement. There you are. Boom. Come on. There she is. Beautiful. Two more bolts, and we are done. A 
Uh-huh. Come on. Just trying to get to the engine here, bruh. Just take that off. Radiator C. Awesome. Stata. Oh, I didn't have a starter, huh? Oh, I forgot that, huh? Oh, okay. Starter. Haboom. In you go. Ah. <laughs> oh, the fuel pump. That's right. Uh, what's the 95% goal? Oh, it's because I took off the panel. All right. You got me. You got me. Good. And last but not least, we have a performance fuel pump. Put in here. There we go. 100% across the board. Wow. $2,473,368. I purchased this for about 118 grand in the junkyard. So if you find one of these and take the time, put the money into it, and you'll get it out. Plus, it's pretty fancy. It's fancy. It's old timey. I love it. It's pretty. And I realized I need to put some. <laughs> I need to put some oil in this joint here quick. So, uh, there you are. Let's put some oil in here. We'll go color it up. We'll go we'll take it to the dyno and see what kind of performance we're going to get out of it. And uh, take it to the driving range. Let's go drive it. Let's go drive it around. Why not? Windows on. Another door. And just trying to move you. Going, there we go. <laughs> it's like, hey man, just want to select you, man. Boom. Now I think this would look real nice and pretty if we just give it a little bit of red. Saturation, but a little, not like cherry red, like bright cherry red, kind of like a darkish British kind of British kind of red. British black red. Metallica. I was saying Metallica? Metallica's here? That would just be ugly. Metallic, that sounds good. The reds are still broken. And paint the car. Good, good. Oh, you pretty. You so pretty, girl. Girl, you pretty. Alright. Out the door we go. Open. Oh. Look how pretty you are. You are a pretty girl. You so nice. Yes. Alright. Let's see what we're going to get out of this, man. Six hundred and eight. Six hundred. Six hundred and eight. Oh my god! I can't talk this morning. Six hundred eight horsepower. Thirteen hundred fifty-five torque. Just a four hundred fifty, four hundred seventy-nine percent return on our performance tuning part investment. That's the two hundred plus uh, policy that we're getting thrown in there. This thing's gonna be. You're gonna be so nice, you know, and you're gonna make someone super happy. So I am not keeping you. I could use the cash. Bring over. To the center and let's go take you for a spin let's first let's see what it looks like on the... oh this is nice oh I like that I like that door opener got the Bentley mm-hmm very well done download it today in the workshop just for you all right no not the junkyard here we go. Let's see how fast she can go. I think it's going to be just fine. I think she's going to be a little bit of alright. Ooh. It's a little too powerful. I'm just 
just trying to keep it straight. The vintage tires, man. It does take a little time to speed up, though. It does. And that's it. That's a wrap. 172 kilometers per hour. Take a drift in, though. That's way faster than it's ever gone before. Oh, oh, oh. Mistakes from mistakes have been made. Mistakes have been made. We're drifting. We're drifting with the Bentley. Oh, it's pretty though. It sure is pretty though, isn't she folks? It sure is. Mm-mm. It's awesome. Love it. Very good. Very good indeed. Folks! If you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. It helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, and good night. Peace out, like shout y'all. And I will check you out right here again. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, baby. Next time.